Welcome to Calvin's Online Math. Uh, let us look at this cubic equation. Solve x cubed minus 2x squared minus 3x is equal to 0. So the first thing you're going to do is check if there's a common factor. And in this case, there's a common factor x. So you write that as x into x squared minus 2x minus 3 is equal to 0. So the product between x and this number here uh, is actually equal to zero. So it means either x is equal to zero or x squared minus 2x minus 3 is the one that is equal to zero. So it means we already have one value for x. Now we can solve this quadratic equation to get other values of x. So we look at this as x squared minus 2x minus 3 is equal to zero. So let us use one of the methods to solve this. We can use factorization method. And if that is the case, we need two numbers whose sum is the same as b. And b in this case is minus 2. And their products should be the same as a times c. That is 1 times negative 3, which is negative 3. And you'll find that those two numbers are negative 3 and positive 1. So just split negative 2 into these two so that you have x squared. Uh, plus x minus 3x minus 3 is equal to 0. So the common factor uh, between these two is x. So you have x into x plus 1. So you expect x plus 1 this side. And you have a negative 3. It means you multiplied 1 by negative 3. And that's equal to 0. So you have x minus 3 times 1 of these. That is x plus 1 is equal to 0. So it means either of these is equal to 0. So if the first one is equal to 0, then x is equal to 3. And if the second one is 0, then x is minus 1. So we have the three values of uh, x, that is x equal to 0, as we found before, and x equal to negative 1, and also x is equal to 3. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.